This is the Kerr bullet. It was the proprietary ammunition for the British Kerr revolver. I've got kind of a weakness for English design stuff. The 54 bore Kerr revolvers and bullets were imported in large numbers to the U.S. for use by both sides during the American Civil War. Here is Gone offers a Kerr bullet mold and I've been using it with success with paper cartridges in my 60 Army. I got the bug to shoot some conicals in my walker. Their Dragoon molds were out of stock. 54 bore to us Yanks is 44 caliber. The largest diameter of the Kerr bullet is .457 which should work in the walker. Got a nice ring of lead on all six chambers, which is a good sign. This is a Uberti kit gun from Dixie Gunworks. It comes in the white but was beautifully timed, just requiring some minor fitting and finishing. The only changes I made to the Uberti was to change out the cones to slick shots and to file a flat spot on the spring to help retain the loading lever. I was pleasantly surprised that this gun didn't have the short arbor issue that plagues a lot of the Uberti guns. The walker is a handful to shoot, originally intended to be carried on the saddle in pairs to keep the horse balanced so it wouldn't fall over. The walker models brought Colt back into the firearms business. But there was a high failure rate for the new pistols, often blamed on poor metallurgy and improper loading.
The curveball is shooting quite high at 25 yards. I'm aiming below the 6 o'clock and just barely caught the 1 o'clock edge of the target. I kept adjusting my aim lower and I got one flyer at the 2 o'clock edge. Heavy loads are fun on the walker, but accuracy suffers, and you burn a lot of expensive and hard to replace powder. Using a reduced load with a filler produced the best results, being this is a 44 walker at one time, the most powerful handgun in the world, and would blow your head clean off, you got to ask yourself one question. Do I feel lucky? Well, do you, pumpkin? Her bullet did the trick and was a treat to shoot. With a little load development, I'm sure it would deliver excellent results.